Earlier this week, we posted a video about a glitch called Collision Overload. The glitch stopped various aspects of the game working, like enemy damage or bombs. What's more, it also let Link walk underwater too. This let Link do anything he could do on land, even at the bottom of a river or the middle of the ocean. This made us wonder, could we now open a treasure chest underwater? Will Link's new abilities let him do that too? Sadly, the answer is no. Even if we can go underwater, we can't open the treasure chest there. Here's what happens when I try to open one in the river near the Dueling Peak stable. As you can see, there's not even an open prompt. So question answered, right? Well no, not necessarily, since in Breath of the Wild, there are actually two types of water. Standard water and box water. The former is anything that's part of the main water plane, whereas the latter is standalone. And the camera actually follows Link underwater in the latter. That's why the camera goes underwater in shrines. This made me wonder, could the camera have an effect here? Could seeing underwater let's open the chest there too? Sadly, the answer is again no. As it turns out, you can't open the chest underwater in a shrine either. Since like before, there's no prompt here. So sorry folks, even with glitches, you can't open treasure chests underwater. Either way, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like, subscribe to our channel if you want to see more, then leave your thoughts in the comments below or on our Discord server today.